everybody it's me back with another vinyl update for you sorry it's been ages since I made a video last um, I've got to be honest I haven't bought any, anything for a good long time um, but I'm back now I've got plenty to show you um, starting with uh, the vinyl um, I have some 45s as well it's a 12 inches so I'll start with 45s first um, I've got here Fright Night it's the main I believe the main theme single song from the film there um, ZZ Ward put the gun down you can see that there's a little bit of glare on the camera I'll try and move around this room and get some good lighting so I don't know how it's gonna turn out anyway next one new kids on the block you got it the right stuff it's brilliant we got a remix on there as well. Yeah, Juice, sorry, Juice Newton, Angel of the Morning. Get that in there. Michael Jackson, You Rock My World. Cool. And the last one here is Starships. Nothing's going to stop us now from the uh, movie Mannequin. So there you have it. Those are the 45s. Okay, moving on to the 12 inches. Okay. Dolly Parton, 9 to 5, and Odd Jobs. Let's get that in there. Um, the better that side? I think it might be better that side. Yeah. Start holding this side. Kenny Rogers, greatest hits. Try not to get that glare. Get that in there. there you go. Now I've already, uh, I believe in a previous video, I've already shown this um, album, but I got it again because it was only for a dollar, and I believe um, the first copy I've got is still sealed, and I decided not to open it, so. I got it again because it wasn't sealed, and again it was only for a dollar. The Back to the Future soundtrack was absolutely it's in great condition for a dollar. I think it's a bit dusty. I think it skips a little bit on the first track on the first side, but other than that, it's, it's in pretty good condition. So I'm happy with that. And the soundtrack, the Rocky soundtrack, the first one. Pretty cool. Okay. Barry White. Can't get enough. It's got a bit of glare. There you go. Just got it in there. Wicked. <laughs> Alright, the fifth dimension with uh, the age of Aquarius. Olivia Newton John making a good thing better. Some very nice headshots there. Linda Rod Ronstadt, Ronstad, heart like a wheel. Pronounce her last name properly. A lot of these were, um, I think, were dollar finds actually um, didn't have that much money that I could fork out for a $20 album as much as I like to because of course all the good ones are roughly around that price be it second hand or brand new carrying on got some more Olivia Newton-John Xanadu soundtrack with um, electric light orchestra that's cool Okay. And to break it all up, brand new vinyl. I guess a lot of people have got this by now. One of the most popular albums out there, I assume. Um, since their first album did so well, and it's uh, Monkford and Sons, Babel. 
I still need to get around to listen, listening to this. I think it's been out for a couple of weeks now. Um, I've only heard the uh, single, I Will Wait. So I'm looking forward to hearing the rest. And, you know, I hope it's as good as the first album. So, fantastic. Okay. And uh, this next um, album is from a band that I've wanted to get on vinyl for quite some time. Uh, I've been putting them off for a while, um, mainly because I've really been in the mood to listen to them, but lately I've been listening to them quite a bit, and especially this album. And it's uh, Reinventing the Still by Pantera. And I have to say, this is my favourite metal band of all time. Um, I'm not really too big on metal anymore, at least uh, metal that's sort of this calibre, you know, this sort of heaviness or whatever you want to call it. Um, but I was a, I was big into them in college and I was a bit guyed when um, Dimebag was shot and I haven't really listened to much metal like that since, so. But that is a great album, um, chuffed the bits to get it, to have got it. Um, okay, one more. Uh, and um, before I show this, I just want to thank um, Rob Elo Fox for getting me into this band. I believe in one of his videos, he was playing the track Black Eyes. And um, I think I messaged, messaged him ages ago about it and wanted to know who the band was that was playing that track. And he said I was a group called Shearwater. So I got into them over the over listening to them on YouTube and um, managed to track down one of their albums absolutely brilliant I mean if you've seen any of his videos he's been banging on about them quite a bit now and he has every right to because I think they're fantastic um, this is their recent album Animal Joy and um, I love it track by track it's amazing I wanted to get this one for a while as well since well since it came out so Yes, indeed. So that's it for the um, for the twelve-inch vinyls albums. Um, the rest I've got to show is little bits and pieces. You probably see in the background there's a new shelf put up there. Um, it's got all sorts of things on there, um, like old school video games and um, what else? I've got a few more cassettes down the bottom right there, and um, some VHSs, which are Sorry, Brandon knows about this. I stole his idea for 80s movies. Um, but they're all there, and I'll probably go through them in, in another video somehow, somewhere. But, um, okay, I'm going to wrap this one up now with just a couple of um, laser discs, because I'm still collecting those. And um, this one I have here is The Crow with Brandon Lee, which is. A really cool movie. And the last one here. Jaws. Not much to say about that really. It's a great flick. And that's it. Uh, it's good to good to be back showing people um, uh, my latest purchases again. Good to be back just making videos actually. Um, it has been a while, I know. Um, I just wish I had more to show. But um, that's it. That's all I've had so far. So um, look out for my next video. Um, I'll go through what's on here. If you want to check that out, if you don't, then it's fine. But I'm going to get to that. So thanks for watching. Um, leave me a message. I'll reply to everybody. So. Let me know how you're all doing, and I'll look out for you guys in your videos. I need to catch up. It's been so long, so I apologize. Um, you take care of yourselves, and I look forward to hearing from you soon. Okay, cheers.